Hey guys, Hackbox Productions here, and um, I am going to show you one of the best gameplays I ever did. Uh, this is with me and my brother. My brother is in Crusader. I don't think they can hear you. Um, so this is it. Uh, this is actually a replay because I didn't know how good it was. Going to be. So it's the replay. So this is. Um, I decided to tell my brother to head out um, where. Um, so we go flanking because not many people decide to go check out over there. So anyways, we went over to okay, that's how the user to decide to shoot the out in the direction that we're going. So my brother's on the left side of the crusader, uh, his name is Falcon SC, and I am in the way to the throw. So we decided to flank around the left side of the hill because we know personally that that little place where F9 is, that place is going to be really hectic, especially because most, the fact that there's two heavies on the other team, there's two heavies, I expected they'll be over there in each, by chance, I knew they were, I saw them over there. So we decided to flank around with my brother and along with the Cruiser 2 and an M7, we decided to flank around. And, um, this is pretty much how it went. Um, I won't tell you exactly how it ended at the end uh, until the last point. So, yeah. I thought that we started by losing in the beginning when, uh, when the SU 85 in, in, towards the left side, towards the north, um, north east. I think it's north east. Yeah, north east side um, with the PZ, PZ1C attempting to scout um, killing himself. But, attempt, um, but succeeded in scouting the other side of the team. We decide to flank around, I see an empty base, so I go into a hold down position, which means my holding my new turret is visible. And you should. And um, I got the kill. Enemy is hit! Target! Although I see the fire. Gotcha! Out. And I was wondering where it was. Over there, it was over there. And uh, I found the PZ. I took a hot shot at it, I did not get the kill. Uh, I tried looking for the M5, the SU-85 again. Uh, although it did damage both my tracks, I did not succeed. So I, I turn around to the right, look at the M4. I have an M4 really weird position, so I decided to just attack it. It's an SU-85. Enemy armor is damaged! And um, while I was doing this, I, was, I noticed something was getting Enemy vehicle destroyed. And the person was getting ricochets in front of us. Two Matildas taking pot shots to the left, along with the M2 taking pot shots. So I took a little shot, I missed. Um, if one of the Matildas starts moving away, so I go for the left. I got shot off of him, on him, but he did not register. Uh, I continue shooting him twice at me. Although the second time I did a uh, game, which is pretty hard if you're shooting from the side. So I did kill on that guy. Uh, I don't know who else got, who got the other Matilda. Some Enemy armor is destroyed. So I don't know. I didn't pay attention and see who got the other Matilda though. So I go for M. I see the M2, and I my brother decides to take my kill. And uh, so uh, I decided to go back on the right. I decide to go around to the left, but I see that um, the troop, the MC, the um, cruiser two was destroyed. So I decided to move in on T80. Uh, I see that they're missing. Continue going forwards. I see that I popped up again. Try to go hold down position. I see a T49. Try to kill. So I go back there and the KV-1 will be occupied with the S-35CA and pz 3 So I move some of it So I move first, I decided to replay my tracks because I know it's going to be a really bad for me to So I get in. Uh, I first, the first thing I spot is when the KV-1, I see it. I decided to shoot its tracks, try attempt to shoot its tracks off, but I get a ricochet. 
KV-1 equipped with a howitzer is I killed its gas tank. And I start to go on to the other one. The, the, the SC-35 tries to come in and tries to spot him. Uh, but I get there first. I didn't want to go down the left because I, I thought I had more life. So these two guys were equipped with, um, they were both equipped with a uh, uh, howitzer. Personally, I don't like howitzer unless they're accurate. I missed again. I don't know how I missed that. But I felt like a man. I could have ran. So, uh, so the S285 uh, tries to go in and um, try to cap. So um, Churchill tells me to go back, uh, go to the other side and have room for us. So we get in. Uh, at the same time, uh, brother is attempting to spot the headset and attempt to kill him. I was saying that he was not going to get the kill because he would not penetrate the headset's arm. But in the end, he somehow, I think he hit the top of the headset and he got the kill. So, while we go in there, I noticed that two captures, so I try to hurry up. Uh, like, track is still broken, so I don't know what to do. So I tell everyone to go back to defend the base. And to go take pot shots. So he he kills the headser, which was very amazing. So uh, right now currently I have the most kills and he has the second most kills. Which um, in the end he uh, he kills the SU-85 along with the M8A1. That's the only way you can actually get those two early kills that he got in the end. So he kills the SU-85. I don't know how. I think she's behind. Uh, MA1 gets the piece. That's what I always do. So in the end, we got. Um, so in the end, we we got a uh, few. Ki we got um, brother in arms, and we also got steel wall, which was pretty amazing because I did not think about. I knew I was going. I might have got steel wall, so I was like, expecting that. Brother in arms, my brother let me know in the end. Brother in arms is if um, each of your patrol member, er, pro tr patrol members get. A uh, platoon members get more than three kills, so we got five kills. Both of us got five kills, and uh, that's we took out. There's twelve people on the team, right? Um, I believe there's 16. So we took out. Okay, well we got something like that. We got ten kills out of the sixteen. Let's just say at or twelve, whatever. But um, that was pretty good. Pretty good. So I'll see you guys in the next one.